going on my super sandwiches rhymes out here and stay back with some more dragon ball z don't come battle no dragon ball fighters unfortunately but the beta does come back tomorrow so we'll be able to record more content around them but for now we'll play some don't come battle now today i want to actually do something a little bit different i'm going to be testing uh against the strength rose event this is the most recent event. Uh, I'm going to be testing an LR based team versus a TUR team and kind of answering the question is, is does it matter if you're running LRs? The answer in the long run is not really. Uh, as D3 said many times before, once a car starts hitting for over a million, which is a very, very common thing these days, it doesn't really matter. You'll be able to power through events left and right. And the whole point of this video is to kind of showcase uh, that no matter which team I'm running, which is going to be this one right here versus uh, this one, so right next to it. Essentially, both of these teams are going to be hitting over like 1.5, 2 million damage. Maybe the LR team will be hitting slightly more around 2.5 to 3 ish, depending on the situation. But the point is, is, it doesn't matter whether you're running an LR team or a TUR team, you're still going to beat the event. So, first things first, let's go ahead and jump in without the, uh, the LR team featuring the TURs. Now, I will point out that I have a lot more weaker units on this team as opposed to the LR team, but the team is going to run a lot better. And the reason why is because, well, LRs are designed to be run uh, with other units. Stuff like uh, regular support units that will power it up and give key, yada, yada, yada. You're supposed to do that. Running a all LR based team, or mostly LRs, the problem you're going to run into is they might clash as far as getting key. So there's going to be situations where you won't get the, the 18 key attack off, which is kind of the big goal to do with LRs. And if you run it like a perfect balance team using stuff like uh, support units and regular units, you're going to be hitting those um, those 18 key attacks much more often as opposed to as you would be doing it with like an LR based team. But the point is, it doesn't matter what you're running, you're still going to be able to power through these events left and right. The only big challenge I'm going to have here is, is when I finish this event, I hope that I can actually find another Strength uh, Rose Goku Black on my friend list because the friend list, is, friend list, the friend system is so garbage in this game. For love of God, just fix it for, for once. Alright, let's see what we got. So, my weakest unit right now is going to be my Super 17 and my, I want to say my Janimba. Janimba I have pretty high up in the dupe system. I think uh, I only got one dupe, but I did get criticals uh, there. So hopefully if I get a crit, I can hit pretty hard. But for the most part, those are be my weaker units. Goku Black is going to, oh, not Goku Black, uh, Super 17 is going to struggle because he has to get attacked first. And I'm not going to stick him in the middle there yet. So I think we'll just keep it like this. So let's just do one of these. We'll do that. And then we'll, we'll do this. Now the reason why I decided to take on the Rose event is because I had not taken this team into the uh the vegeta blue event i would have had a type advantage because i'm using lr goku black and i'm using the rose and i want to do that so this is kind of like a neutral fight neutral fight i actually wasn't paying attention to how much damage was done there but i did see that i did hit a critical there uh with the second attack i think with um what's his face Six hundred thousand. all right how much is it gonna hit for let's see what happens so 70k ish i think uh that's about how, about how much i'm gonna take damage to as well with the lr team but I could be wrong, we'll see how much it actually is when it comes down to the actual match when I do round 2 uh, in about 5 minutes or so, depending on how long it takes me to get there. 86,000, again, my Super 17 is not going to be doing that much damage. Okay, uh, I'm going to go ahead and put you in the back because he's my, one of my weaker units. Let's put you in the front first to attack with you because I don't want to, you know, just be all the Goku Black show. Um, and then let's just do this. Okay, let's see what happens here. Now the beauty of this team is, is you don't need 18 key. These guys are going to link together you're going to pull off super attacks left and right. The problem with the other guys, the LRs, is even though their 12 key to 17 key attack damage still do a lot, they're not going to be hitting for uh, you know their most max potential because, again, they won't be hitting that 18 key plus mark most of the time. Uh, Alright, let's see what we got now. So we got agility. Let's do. Let's actually rotate out Goku Black just so I don't have a focus around him. Uh, as far as defense, <laughs> cooler. Granted, he's 100% cooler is disgusting right now. We'll do this, we'll do that, and I don't even need two for you, and then we'll just do, I guess, we'll just do this. Okay, let's see how this works out. Now, uh, the thing about Golden Frieza is he is disgusting. He's going to hit for, like, I'd say 1.2 million, I want to say. Or, no, 900,000, actually. Way less, actually. A lot less. So, it looks like Goku Black is a little bit tankiness behind him. Cooler was 100%. Half a million with a... So, 600,000, if you combine both of them, if you do the math, give or take a couple of points there. Uh, 84k for the damage, tank the rest of it, and then Goku Black, who's probably only going to hit for like 300,000 because of the type disadvantage. Uh, potentially, we'll see what happens here. Way less, actually, 253,000, and still eat that damage. Okay, uh, let's put, I think, you know, it's time to put you right there. Let's get some damage there. Let's, let's mitigate some damage. He only has 26,000 defense. But he does reduce the attack by 30%, I believe. So we'll do this. I'm still not going to heal because the goal also here is to not be healing that much. Because uh, the thing I can do with the LR team, which is the beauty of it, because of LR Goku Black, that is, I can uh, I can worry about not using items because I'll be able to heal using uh, the passive with uh, LR Goku Black every time he pops up. 
This is gonna hit for okay, barely anything. My my Super Saiyan team is pretty garbage. He has SA10, but that's about it. I didn't put anything in there as far as the dupe systems because I pulled him so late in the game. And at this point, there's no point honestly in even investing. Look at that 1.6 million. There's no point in investing any more orbs into him. So as you guys notice that my Merge Zamasu hit for 1.6 million, which is probably a common number you're gonna see with the LRs in a second. Granted, it was a critical, but without a critical, he's hitting for about I think 900,000 to one more one million ish. Um, granted, he is pretty high in the dupe system too, but keep that in mind. Let's put um, let's put you in the back there. We'll, we'll do this. So I still don't want to heal. So I have 200,000 HP. If I get super attack, it could be disgusting. Uh, let's just do this. We'll do that for you, so we can get uh, those uh, similar orbs. And I guess we'll end it with this. Let's see if I'm gonna make a mistake here and not healing. That's kind of the goal too. It's kind of the goal too is to not heal. Is to see if I can just power through this without the use of LRs. Again, LRs are kind of just meant to be flashy in the game. They're cool. It's like, oh my god, I'm pulling an LR. Um, but they hit for a bajillion. But thing is, is people forget that these units hit for bajillions too, left and right. Granted, not right now because type disadvantage. But it's okay. The critical actually worked, made up for it, so that worked out too. With a third additional attack, can we get another critical? Let me get another critical. And the other beauty of it is, I'm pretty sure that, oof, of course against him. Of all people, of course it's against him. 93,000, that's actually pretty good considering he had the type advantage over me. Can I get a critical with this? This is not going for a lot. This is not going for a lot, 380,000. Dodge and dodge, I'll take it. All right, he's almost dead. Let's see what we got. Let's actually put you in the front. So we're gonna rotate you out again because again I don't want him to do most of the stuff. Uh, I'm still not gonna heal, even though I might regret that here in a second. I'm still not gonna heal. And let's try to get a Dokkan attack built up. Uh, since you are doing a little bit less damage because of the, the nature of uh, this team, you actually have more room to build out that Dokkan attack. And like when you get to the like last round, you can bust out that Dokkan attack and destroy whatever event you're facing. Whereas with the LRs, they're just naturally hitting over a million plus every single time. Again, LRs are always going to be hitting for the most, well, usually the most, but you don't really necessarily need them to maximize the damage. Also, later this week, I'm going to do another video, which I'm not going to spoil what it is yet, because I kind of want you guys to stay in the in the um, unknown with it. Um, i got another video coming out later this week that's going to be really interesting as well. Okay, let's do this for you. We'll do that for you. Uh, you know what? Just to be safe, I am actually going to go ahead and heal. I didn't really want to, but I'm just, I, I'd am i rather not get, you know, bodied by accident because I'm being cocky and give all those to you. Let's see what happens here. I should have my Dokkan attack up by next turn, and uh, who's my hardest hitting unit? I would say my hardest hitting unit maybe is Frieza. If not, maybe Merge Zamasu, because he's so high up in the, in the dupe system. I would say Cooler, but Cooler has a type disadvantage, so I don't want to waste a Dokkan attack on him. So we'll figure it out, but we got a Dokkan attack coming here really soon, and once I'm done with that, um, it's pretty much going to be the, the end of the event, and I'll jump in with the LRs and show you guys what it's like to run a full LR team as opposed to a TUR team. Again, ideally, it's, it's better to mix them, mix them together, a couple of TURs, maybe an LR or two, uh, with like support units that will increase attack, defense, key, yada, yada, yada. That's like the best way to go about it. Okay, let's see what we got. Uh, so if I work this out correctly, let's put you in the back because you're taking a lot of damage there. Let's do... You know what, just in case... Oh, no, I don't want to do that. Okay, let's try Let's try to not get the Dokkan attack off. So we'll do this, we'll do that, and then we'll do this. This is not going to be a Dokkan attack. It is not! It's very, very close, though. Let's see what we got. So, minimize damage with the Janimbus Guard. Not that it would really matter that much. If I got super attack, I'll still take a lot of damage there, but a little bit less than normal. 300,000. Got a dodge there. Uh, this is going to hit for, I want to say, let's say a cool 800,000. Without the critical. If it crits, it's going to be like 1.1 million. Way less, actually. So he's a lot tanky. I, I keep underestimating how tanky these guys are. He's maxed out now, but he's still not going to be hitting that hard because, uh, again, Super 70 is not meant to be a attack unit. He's more of a damage mitigator. Like, look at him just reducing a lot of damage. Super attack? Perfect. Watch him, like, reduce the damage from this attack as well to about, let's say, 70,000, I want to say. No, 40,000. 40,000. 40,000. Even less. 30,000. That's what he's there for. Uh, okay. Now, oof. Who's my hardest, hardest hitting unit? I think it's Frieza, to be honest. I definitely think it's Frieza. Well, actually... Hmm... Do I do it with him? I'm gonna just do it with him, because, yeah. Okay, let's do it with him. We'll do that, and then Freezy Pop can do it. This should finish the job off here in a second. Unless they survive, and then I get super attack against Cooler, in which case that's gonna be a problem, and I'm gonna be dead there. Which would be hilarious on video! All right, let's see if I can get all of these. One, two, three, four, five, six. Perfect, look at that. I thought I actually missed a lasso, but it worked out. All right, 
This should do, I want to say, at least a cool million. If he doesn't crit. If he doesn't crit. Which has a small chance to crit. I don't know the best Goku Black. I don't know if that was actually the friend one or not, but there's a chance he could crit. But I'm going to go up and hit for him. Okay, so 920,000. I was pretty close. And then Cooler. Cooler should finish it off, even though he does have the type disadvantage. Wow, so this took me like, what, five minutes to do? Six minutes, seven minutes? I don't really know. 245,000 actually on that one. But it's still enough to finish the job. Okay, so let's actually back out and see how much time that took. That took me... It's funny, I'm, I made this video to kind of like to show off the difference between LRs and TURs. I'm not really doing a good job here. But the point I'm trying to make is, is, is you have units uh, like TURs that are still going to be hidden for a lot. And you, you don't necessarily need LRs. Like LRs are cool, they're flashy, but you don't need LRs. So 9 minutes and 24 seconds, that's actually a big difference. Because I know if I, once I run my TURs, uh, it's going to be a, a lot faster. Alright, let's go ahead and jump in. Uh, well, I, I hope I can find a... A strength rose. I don't know why strength rose is so hard to find on here. Like it's a new unit, and like it's not like it's been. Oh, there we go. We got one, and we got a decent one too. Okay, I was about to say, switch over to the to the uh, LRs and jump in. Now I do want to point out that uh, I'm going to have a massive advantage with LR Majin Vegeta in this situation. I just thought about that as I started uh, recording. Now, uh, if I wasn't using LR Majin Vegeta, I probably. I mean, I would still have a massive advantage, but I feel like it wouldn't be as fast as it would with Majin Vegeta. Because, like, literally, I can one-shot every single event, especially once I get to the strength part. Even against the agility part, I'm still going to be destroying this man left and freaking right. So, yeah. All right, let's get some key here, because I'm going to need it for my LRs. If it gives me some uh, key... Give me some key for the LRs, man! Come on, don't be stingy! Wow. Wow. Way to be helpful, game. Wait, there we go. We got one for Goku Black, and then that's... I guess that's going to be it. All right, let's see uh, the difference now when you run a... Mostly LR team with one physical unit that's not an LR, which is my cooler. That's, yeah, that's actually funny that it's him. Let's see how this works out. So, uh, I'm going to go ahead and attack with you first. Uh, and again, I don't want to be the big focus around Goku Black, so I'm going to rotate him out here in a second. And then we'll do this. I don't think... I don't think this is going to be enough to, to beat Goku Black. So, 57,000. I don't think it's going to be enough to beat him. Because he only hits for like 500k per attack, usually-ish. Yeah, 500k with the second one happening, another 500k, so a cool million, and then Cooler might finish the job off because if I get, if I get, especially if I get an additional super attack, he might have finished the job off. If not, he's gonna barely survive, which is exactly what happened in the beginning of the last round, if I remember correctly. Oh, he got the critical. Okay, so in this situation, <laughs> the TUR actually helped out. The TUR definitely helped out. Granted, I think I started with uh, with Super Seventeen in the first round, which slowed me down a little bit. If I had a better uh, agility unit, extreme unit, that's other than Super 17, I'll be able to show, showcase it a lot better. All right, so here we go. Let's actually, I, I want him linked with you, so I'm gonna leave you right there. That's going to be a 18 key attack, just barely. Uh, barely, we'll do that. And then, of course, the big weakness with LRs is they don't have, um, they don't have as much key, but that's okay, because with Majin Vegeta, you don't want that anyways. Majin Vegeta, you just want at least 12 to 17 key to like do the most damage, and that's what's beautiful about that card. All right, let's see what we got. So you got attack was well, 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 only once. So he has a 30% boost, I want to say. 1.1 million. He's at the top advantage. So that's why normally it would be hitting for a lot less. Um, and on top of that, he's linked with Goku Black. And I think Goku Black might actually finish the job here. I'll be real with you. I think he can finish the job here. Just kidding. Maybe not. I was hoping for that critical. And then Maj Vegeta is going to just finish that because, again, he's just dirty. Maj Vegeta is just so dirty, especially mine because it's 100%. Okay. So let's go ahead and jump in into this part. Let's see what we got. Uh, we're gonna put you in the back again. Lack of linkage right there. Look at that lake. Lack of linkage. Um, I actually want those for for Bojack. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead and not get a super attack off. Uh, see, this is what I was talking about. The lack of key. The lack of key is gonna hurt you. I can do that though, at least, and then bring those purples down, and then I can do that. Which is not even gonna be. Oh, it is. It is. Okay, just barely is uh, the maxed out. Super attack. So here we go. Broly did nothing, obviously. Uh, he's gonna do nothing because type of oh, critical helped out. Critical helped out. Uh, additional attack. One more. No, not one more. This might be. This might honestly beat him, because Bojack is disgusting. He just has high damage. Although I have a lot of health, so I might have uh, a little bit less than normal there. Seven hundred eighty-nine thousand. I think if I had a lot less health, I'll be able to do way more damage. But in uh, in return, I'm gonna take a lot less damage right now, which is nice too. And we got the super attack. So what did he hit me before? Like 90,000 was the last time? 70,000? 50,000, even less. But again, to be fair, B Mr. Bojack is as tanky as it gets. Okay, let's see what we got. Uh, I guess we'll, we'll just do this. This is probably the best setup. Although it's kind of unfair because... You know what? I'm not going to do that. I'm going to rotate out that one. 
because I wanna, I wanna, I wanna, I mean, I'm gonna make a point here. So we'll do this. That's gonna be a ultra super attack, and then I guess you can finish the job. Cause why not? And then doesn't matter because they already got key because of the passives. Yada yada yada. Let's see what we got here. Okay, 2.3 million base damage. I wanna say this is gonna hit for a cool million again. 960,000, close enough, but it's just enough to finish the job here. All right, so it's, it is a lot faster. It is a lot faster, but you see that my point I was trying to make in the video is is. It doesn't matter. Like with TURs, you're still gonna be hitting really hard, especially if you have them like boosted enough in the uh, in the orb system. All right, this is gonna be the finale. To be honest, no links. Again, this is what I'm talking about. No links right here. So I just do this. This is gonna be what uh, was that? 15 key. We'll do that for you. Unfortunately, this is like a terrible rotation too, so that's why. Um, and then we'll do that. Let's see how this works out. So super attack. This is gonna do nothing. I want to save 40,000 again. Cause I'm tanky and I got the type of advantage. Forty thousand ish, twenty nine thousand. Okay, I I'm getting close. If this doesn't kill him, it was close. Very very close. Also keep in mind, Goku Black is tanky, so hitting for one point four million is still pretty disgusting. This is not gonna kill him though, unless I get the magical crit, which is not gonna happen. But yeah, three hundred sixty one thousand as expected. With another one doing just about the same. So. It's funny. I mean, I don't know. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below of, you know, overall running LRs or an LR team versus a TUR team and balancing out. Um, later this week, like I said, I do have a video planned. I think I might do it this weekend. I'm not going to spoil what it is yet, but I think it's going to be a really, really fun one. Keep an eye out for that. Uh, but other than that, oh, look at the additional attack. Can we get a critical on this? If we get a critical here, this is going to be game. No critical. 169,000. That's actually funny. Um, let's finish it with Coco Black, because why not? Can I get the Ultra Super Attack? I cannot. I have what? Just barely. Just barely. Look at that. Oh, I do actually have enough. Look at that. Okay, so we'll do that. Bring those down. And then just in case we need it, uh, we can get a regular 12 key or I guess 13 key attack with the Bojack as well. All right, let's see how much we can finish the match for. See how much we can finish this for. 2.1 million boost. Probably one hit for 900,000. 800,000. That was close enough. And the time on that is. Let's actually find out. Granted, I wasn't really like speeding through it. You can see kind of the difference here. The time is, I want to say like four minutes, five minutes. Load, come on, come on, work with me. Wow, of course it doesn't want to load right now. Hey, not ranked up. Look at that. Uh, the time here is five minutes and fifty-seven seconds. So that's five minutes fifty-seven seconds versus nine minutes and twenty-four. I guess I had that four-minute uh, advantage, but again, Majima G that was kind of like powering through. I should, I should, if I ran it without Majima G, I feel like it would have been a little bit slower. But I had no other option of what to replace him with, unless I ran like Super 17, which would kind of defeat the, the purpose and the point of this video. But yeah. LRs are cool, they hit for a lot, but don't forget that TURs can hit for a lot as well, especially if you're boosted. That's kind of the point of the video. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed us today. My name is Rhyme Style. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.